In this video, uh, we are going to discuss about the while and the do while loop in Kotlin. Okay, so in the previous video, we discussed about the for loop in Kotlin and the basic idea of loop. So loop is used in programming to repeat a specific block of code until certain condition is met. Okay, so loops are what makes computer interesting machine. Imagine you need to print a sentence 50 times on your screen. Uh, you can do it by using a, a print statement 50 times or you can use loops so uh, we will start with the while loop and um, firstly we will discuss the syntax of the while loop okay so for while loop we will first write the uh, keyword while and inside uh, and open a parenthesis and inside the parenthesis we will write the text expression or i can say the condition okay so when the condition is true uh, it enters the the code block and uh, there is a code sequence and after this there is a we close the uh, parenthesis okay so uh, the curly braces okay so uh, whenever the text expression is true it enters into the code sequence and the particular code sequence is repeated okay so test expression inside the parenthesis is a boolean expression if the test expression is evaluated to true statement inside the while loop are executed then the test expression is evaluated again this process goes on until the test expression is evaluated to false if the test expression is evaluated to false while loop is terminated okay so uh, now we will uh, take an example of while loop in which we will print um, line five times or ten times okay so uh, I'll in the main function I'll just introduce a variable so unlike uh, for loop we have to initialize and increment the variable in while loop okay then I'll use the while keyword and while i is less than or equal to 10 okay i have to print i and at the end of the loop i have to increase i also okay i have to increment the value of i if i have not incremented the value of i the the y loop couldn't have ended okay so uh, when i run the program the output is okay so when i run the program the output is okay uh, instead of i is 5 i have to make i is 1 and when i run the program the output is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and 10 okay so uh, notice that plus plus i statement yeah or i plus plus statement inside the while loop okay so we have incremented i at the end of while loop after 10 iteration i will be incremented to 11 okay so if i uh, print the value of i here so i would be equal to 11 at this particular case okay uh, so it goes back to the test 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 statement and the condition i is less than equals to 10 is false okay so therefore the loop terminates so if the body of loop has only one statement uh, it is not necessary to use a curly brace as we did in the uh, if and the uh, when statements so uh, now we will move forward to the do while loop so uh, the syntax for the uh, do while loop is uh, there is a so we will firstly write the uh, do okay I'll just remove this we will firstly write the do keyword and then uh, and then write a code sequence and uh, after this we will end this and after this code sequence I'll write while while keyword and then here I will write the test expression 
okay so uh, we will first uh, discuss the that how do while loop work so uh, the code inside the body of do construct is executed once without checking the test expression then the test expression is checked if the test expression is so the code is uh, executed once and then the test expression is checked okay so if the test expression is evaluated to true code inside the body of the loops are executed once again okay and the test expression is evaluated again the process goes on and on until the test test expression is evaluated to false okay so when the test expression is evaluated to false do while loop terminates so what is the main difference between while and the do while loop is in do while loop the code sequence is executed at least one time and even if the test expression is false okay uh, as not in the while loop because in while loop it will first check the condition and if the test expression is false it will just go on to the it will just terminate the loop okay it will not go, go on in the body of the loop so now we will um, go ahead and try the same with the do while loop and uh, print the in uh, natural numbers from 1 to 10 so i'll uh, write do and then in the code sequence i'll write print statement and before writing the print statement i have also i, I have to also in initialize a variable that is i and then inside the print statement i have to print the variable and increment the variable because if i had not incremented the variable the loop will go on and on and on and will not stop okay so then i'll use the while keyword and inside the while keyword i'll write i is less than equals to 10 okay and then when i run this program i can find that the output is 1 to 10 okay so uh, now what if i had not incremented this and i had just used the print statement as i mentioned the loop will go on and on and on and it will not stop on its own so now what to do if the loops goes on and on so in the command prompt you will just do control plus c okay or you can do is uh, terminate the loop from here the stop okay so take care in mind that um, the loop will not continue to infinite and mention the increment statement here so till now we have covered about about the loops and basic example not I, I will not say example we have just learned the syntax from here okay so you might have a pretty good understanding of loops okay thank you